watch yourself, because you can get dropped just like that. Are you ready? Are you ready? ready? Let's get it on. Fight. Here we go. That was a two-piece dinner with no biscuits. Oh, wow. I love it when the ladies fight. Oh, nice kick to the legs. Circle out. Circle out. Oh, my God. Bodies being found on Greenleaf. Oh, Holly Holm kicked the dog shit out of her and put her to bed. Mm. No! Look at this shit here. And that's all she wrote. It's a science to this shit, man. Being in that octagon is a science, man. It ain't just go out there and just swing, you know, wild. You gotta have a strategic plan about yourself. Understand it. There you go. Oh, my God, that was a big punch. Oh, man, this is one hell of a fight, man. Oh, boy. Oh my God, that's a wrap. Now let's watch some of those replays. Right here, let's show it again. And here we go, knockout mode, baby, where you can get knocked out just like that. We got to go for the knockout, cuz what's happening? Here we go. <laughs> oh, nice kick to the leg. Oh, man, he looks really rocked. They used to be best of friends, and they're fighting over that girl. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. I told you, man, when your health bar get low, you got to back up. Let's see what you working with. What you going to do? Oh, shit. That's one of those. Didn't I tell you to leave me alone? I told you I'm not, I don't want to fight, but go to bed. And he's beating here. You ready? You ready? It's a science to this shit, man. Being in that octagon is a science, man. It ain't just go out there and just swing, you know, wild. You got to have a strategic plan about yourself. Understand it. Mm. Nobody wants to lose. They going all out. Set him up with the one, two. Microphone check, one, two, one, two. Finish. Mm. He's out. That is a book that can be judged by its color. I'm going to put your ass back under the blankets. Here's a pillow and your favorite nursery rhyme. Bye, bye, baby. Tree top. And here we go. Knockout mode. Watch yourself, because you can get dropped just like that. This is high octane fighting. The highest level of fighting. MMA. UFC. Oh, he barely caught. That was the Phantom Punch. He got a little power on him. I told you, man, when your health bar get low, you got to back up. Oh, 
I'm gonna be sipping out a straw for a month. This game's some Hawaiian punch, huh? He's out! You up late. He nailed his ass. He nailed his ass in the, the canvas. Ready? Ready? It's a science to this shit, man. Being in that octagon is a science, man. It ain't just go out there and just swing, you know, wild. You gotta have a strategic plan about yourself. Understand it. Feel not an application, feeling him out. Oh, nice kick to the leg. Back up, man. Your bars is low. He is a bad, bad man. He is a bad, bad man. Yes, sir. I love it. I love it. That's a wrap. Here we go with the slow-mo. Now I need to go slow motion. And here we go. Knockout mode, baby, where you can get knocked out just like that. Oh, they, they going for the knockout. One hit a quarter. Swinging for the fences. Boom, top of the head. Damn, he slapped him, cuz. Look, you see how he slapped him? Boop, boop. I could teach you a lot, but you got to be willing to listen. Airbag. This is a squad right here. I love it. See, when you smell it, when you smell blood, you got to attack. You gonna knock him out, you gonna play with him all night. Look at your health bars. Look back up, man. Hold his hands and sock him. He's out. Let's do it, let's say right about, let's close the store right now. Come on now, let's get cracking. Look at it. That was a double up for your ass. You may need to put some fire on the end of that hit right there cause that was smoking hot. Put his fat ass to bed. Boom! Rocked his legs, he broke his leg back. He smells blood in the ocean. In the middle of the Atlantic Ocean, that is. Look at this! like that to chase. Oh man, stop the press. Stop the press. Stop the press. It's all done. See ya. It's a Christmas gift. That's a wrap. Look at it. Boom.
All right, coming up next, a matchup to determine the baddest man on the planet. The UFC heavyweight title is on the line. All right, so here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, making the walk to the octagon here tonight. He is challenging the champion, whom he has bad blood with, whom he believes he is better than. And obviously, as he makes the walk here tonight, he finally has the chance to prove that he and not the champion is the man who deserves the distinction as the baddest man on the planet. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. All right, so here he is making his way to the Octagon for another heavyweight title defense. This has been the baddest man on the planet now for several years, and he has taken on all comers more often than not, leaving them twitching on the canvas. Knockout power for days. The question is tonight, with a challenge like this, can he walk out the way he came in? as the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. Now let's get you our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. It's a sports. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, and a professional record of 44 wins, 13 losses. He stands six feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 250 pounds. Fighting out of Moscow, Russia, presenting the challenger, Alexander Drago. And now, we're going to see the champion fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 24 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending USC heavyweight champion of the world, Mr. Untouchable. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go down right now. And we are underway. All right, so Well, of course, his status now is that of a UFC legend, but it wasn't all that long ago that he was plying his trade in the WFA. You fast forward a couple of years now, and he's the VIP invite to these WFA events, talking to the young, impressionable fighters. And he says to them, and he told us this story during fight week, I was sitting in those locker rooms wondering if I was ever going to get out of the minor leagues and get to the big show, but I always had the self-belief. I always felt like I had the skills to get there, and now a few short years later, 
He has been stamped a UFC legend. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent. Whoa! That hurt him. The champ is in big trouble. He's in deep danger right now. Who saw this coming? Just over three minutes to go. He's fainting with that kick. Oh. Hook shot blocked there by Volkov. That kick lands. Oh, he got tagged again. He's hurt. This could be it. Powerful oh. right hand. Big shots. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Misses with the right hand. Oh! oh! He got tagged. He's got him hurt here. He tagged him again. Volkov goes for the clinch now. Looks like a recovery mechanism here, Joe. Oh, big left. Vicious combinations. Good shot. That knee might have landed there. How about oh, he that tagged him. He tagged him with the right hand. Under a minute now to go round one. Able to check that kick as well. Lands to the body. Look at that, right to the temple. Oh! Oh, you heard him. Body kick, look at that. Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. Oh, straight right. Hey, stop. Round two next. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. There's a powerful kick to the body. Real stop punches. That's what I like to see. This next round. Brittany Palmer with us. Here we are, early round two. That last round was absolutely wow. He's out! A huge kick for the knockout victory. Well, that was a no-doubter, Joe, and he's made a career of knocking guys out with kicks, but that one right there might have just been the best yet. Caught the opponent flush, full force. Outstanding extension with the leg, and really, once he connected with the target, you knew the end of the fight was coming, and immediately his opponent goes to the canvas. A major, major result here in this division tonight. Let's see that again. Boom! Right on the money. So on the sport's biggest stage, he comes up large. The baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion of the world, your winner and by knockout here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at nine seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Mr. Untouchable. So the celebration is on, and it figures to continue deep into the night for the UFC heavyweight champion and still after the knockout victory here tonight. And given all this man has accomplished, I think you can still argue that tonight is the crowning achievement of his mixed martial arts career. Knocks out the number one contender with style points to retain his heavyweight title. Congratulations to champion, coach, team, family on the big result here tonight.